Hi guys, Raven the Scottish Red Engine here, and welcome to my review on the Tommy Douglas. Tommy Douglas was first released by Motor Road and Rail in 2006 and came with a red troublesome truck with a happy face. He was then re released by the Hit Toy Company with no changes. He was then released by Trackmaster Tommy with yet again, drum roll please, no changes. Douglas was also released by the Hit Toy Company, but this time by himself. Douglas was also released by Trackmaster with loads of changes. A different face, different sticker details, cab windows removed, longer cab roof, and a different tender. Some people never like the Trackmaster Donald and Douglas because they're knockoff toys, including their plastic axles. Well, my Trackmaster Douglas doesn't have the plastic axles on the tender. So you know what guys? I like the Trackmaster Donald and Douglas because I've had them both over five or six years. And I also like, like the Tommy versions of Donald and Douglas as well. But going back to the topic of Douglas, Playra was planning to release Douglas by himself, but was canceled for some reason. However, Douglas was released by Playroll but not by himself. He was released with his twin Donald in a Playroll set called Donald and Douglas Snowplow Clearing Set, based off the season two episode, The Deputation. This Playroll set features the only Playroll release of Douglas. Tommy Douglas looks absolutely fantastic. I mean, I don't have the happy face red troublesome truck so I customized the grey truck into a red truck and to add to Douglas but one day I will get a happy red troublesome truck on eBay so stay tuned guys but going back to the topic of Douglas the reason why Douglas looks fantastic is because his body design is the same size as his twin Donald's like Donald and Douglas's Tommy body designs are exactly identical and the same. Like, Douglas's model was the reused version of the Tommy Donald's model. They managed to add the square stickers and the cab details, as in the cab windows, but the stickers on the nameplate and numbers are extremely different. And there's one thing I always liked about Douglas. I love how he had the laughing face when he was released, just to make him a little more unique. And as you guys could probably tell, my Tommy Douglas had a wonky eye, which I never liked. It was really annoying, so I tried many times to fix Douglas's eye, and it didn't go quite well. His eye was way too big, so I had to start again from scratch, and I had to use a black sharpie, and bingo! His eye is exactly the same as his left eye. But going back to Douglas, I have three kinds of Douglas. The Tommy, the Trackmaster, and the blue version of Douglas. Back in 2021, I wanted to get the Tommy Donald and Douglas because I want to customise them into their blue liveries. You really thought I was going to use this Douglas as my real Douglas? Maybe, maybe not. I will be using this blue Douglas along with my blue Donalds. I have three Donalds and three Douglases, by the way, guys. And going on to the cons about Douglas, I don't like how he has the stickers because sometimes people find it annoying that engines were released with stickers and they seem to come off very easily. My Tommy Douglas's sticker was printed off because when I first got him off of eBay, his nameplate sticker was completely ruined and it fell off. So I had to print off a new one and it was exactly the same size. It doesn't look too bad, but this Tommy Douglas could use some improvements. I painted his handrail in silver, but the paint is starting to fade away, so I'll have to start again from scratch. Overall, I think Douglas looks brilliant. I would definitely recommend getting Tommy Douglas because 
Douglas is one of the most rarest characters to get whenever you're looking for a Trackmaster Douglas or a Tommy Douglas. He's also expensive and quite hard to find, just like Oliver, because the reason why Oliver's expensive is because he was never released in the United States. So he was only released in England and Japan. But anyways, I think Douglas looks brilliant. Overall, I would give Tommy Douglas a 9 out of 10. Now, let's give Douglas a run. Let me get Donald on the track. Let me put Trackmaster Douglas and Blue Douglas on. Oh wait, I just realised I took out the AA battery out of my Blue Douglas, so I'll have to get more AA batteries. Let's get Trackmaster Donald on as well. Uh oh. That's all for today, folks. I hope you enjoyed watching my Tommy Douglas going around the new layout I just built. And I hope you enjoyed seeing Tommy Donald and my Trackmaster Donald and Douglas. Be sure to click subscribe and give a thumbs up on my videos. So, without being, with that being said, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all later. Goodbye.